Hello, I am Casa Sheva here and welcome back to uh, my my hometown running a solemn save here and today we can secure promotion we are already secured playoff to division 3 so hopefully it will happen as you can see it's gone pretty good one eight one against alter uh, dollar our biggest result maybe a big maybe even our biggest victory ever i was well, just because I moved that, that seems silly. Oh well. Now at least uh, some Muller. Uh, so Isa Dalin. Nee, Isa Lundin. <laughs> Not Isa Dalin. Uh, on the rebound there. I don't know why I can't go. Just. Ah! Oh, stop being annoying. Stop annoying me, game. Maybe I have to see the real highlight to get back to the game. Isaron Dean again, I believe it's one of, I'm going to see in the league actually how he's doing there. Christopher Fredriksson, uh, Fredriksson with a free kick there and then he scored another goal in the 94th minute here. Very lovely. And who else scored here? Terra. Terapum Bukalin scoring as well and then Andre Muller has been very insignificant or not as good as he used to be. Score he scored two goals here, so a great start after the those matches uh, against teams that were pretty good. Now we met teams that were way worse than us. But still to win eight one was really impressive here. So Brolanda we won against as well. Milotic there is a little need. Uh, Gorda was a really tough match though. They were about to come back. Morton Sada scoring three goals there, but Fisnet saved us in the end. Uh, Isa Lundin again scoring the goals. Ho Holland, yeah, here we were about to lose again. Uh, David uh, Alcaron McCallum scored the goals for us, so it'll be very lovely there. The win, and now we have Karlsson and Westerwos left here. Yeah, I think we might do, yeah, I had a little bit of a backup. Okay, yeah, no one of my players has scored enough. Uh, what about average rating then? Because that's always interesting to see. We should have someone there, maybe at least. Where is average rating? I don't find it. <laughs> There it is. Uh, Andre Holmquist is four. Yeah, let's just go uh, to the match. I believe, yeah, we have five points before, so even if we just get the point here, and as long as they don't win, Umidal uh, we are through. So Emil Drago, I don't know if we're going to be able to get him. I, mean, I guess I can see if his contract is. I would say backup, but whatever. And uh, so Drago, Adnan, Westerlund, uh, Ahmed Ali, Nilsson, Holmquist, Bukalin, as uh, attack in there, Fredriksson, uh, Milotic, Eriksson, and Isa Lundin. I just want to see, even if it's not scoring most, he's. Done his best season as you see, 19 goals of 25 matches, so not too bad at all as you can see. It. I feel like if they don't get three points, we still could go up even with a loss here. Since we have what, five points before, so I think we are going to do the awards uh, after this. Or, yeah, I guess we'll see. Oh man, that was a big... your uh, freaking assistant take out the bench. <laughs> because, no, he apparently need what is that, two strikers, two defenders, one central midfield, but no, no wingers. No, why do we need wingers? <laughs> it's not like he gets hurt a lot, injured a lot of times. He can still play. Oh, Imidal is leading. Uh, oh, this is not good. Uh, I have to think here. We have five. And then it's just two points. So we might need to play the last match of the season. 
um, without Andre Holmquist because I'm pretty sure. Or can maybe Adnan can play there? And I want Isa Lundin there actually, and then Alcaron in the metal. Adnan, yeah, I know he isn't really good enough there, but what what do we do? <laughs> this issue. Might still go offensive though, still. I have one shot on target, and of course they score that. <laughs> of course that is what's going to happen. Ah, uh, draw would even... Uh, still probably leading, I don't see that it would lose here. Adnan, ooh, Bukalin, can you score here? Ooh, could have been, could have been chance there. Uh, I'm going to actually take Meller, because he's been better. As a shadow striker. <clears throat> Fortunately, it seems like we're not creating that much today. Isa Lundin, oof, over the bar there. Yeah, we might need to play the second match. Oh, we just have to get one victory. Because we before we are before them in the table, so... I guess we will do... I believe it's seven days between, so... Yeah. I hope we're not bottling this. I'm scared now that we will bottle this. Okay, let's go attacking here. <laughs> this is disappointing. We have a lot of shots, but all of them have been outside. Maybe I should have done more changes here as well. Oh, that's a great two injuries as well. Now they have a draw though. So that might be enough actually. <laughs> what under well four they have four points. Yes! <laughs> what underwhelming time. We win the promotion here by a loss to call some really bad performance. But since Umedal just take a point, uh, I guess we will just see here. And then I will be back for after I play that last match of the season. Should be in alphabetic order. Uh, here we have it. Yeah, they did just draw, did draw against Broland, so we are promoted with four points ahead to Umedal. As you can see there, Banamo can go before, but um, and I guess it depends. Is it goal difference? They have way better goal difference, to be fair. Uh, it is goal difference, so Banamo uh, can go before Umedal. So now we, uh, this was what I was worried for, uh, for that we wouldn't win like three times in a row. Now it's going to definitely be tougher, Division 3. Like I said, I think Division 2 or Division 3 that's, is disappointed that the team only won Division 4. Is. What? <laughs> what they, they, they want to be, to be like the best Division 4 team ever. <laughs> That's just ridiculous. Oh man, a lot of injuries here and suspensions. So yeah, oh, yeah we have Vesteros, like I said, they are bottom team, so we're not going to do that match. I'm just going to be back. But yeah, we had a great run here and then it's weird. It's sick to know we lost to there. We we lost to a lot of clubs that isn't even that great. Eight are them. I mean, this was one match, uh, one team we were actually the said was we lost uh <laughs> there are two teams we lost uh like I mean losses to have five so two of those teams are really good the other three is pretty poor uh so they have a chance actually Vesteros to save themselves well wait oh well I will be back uh well, and we will see who has won the awards and such. So, see you all soon again. What kind of bullshit is this? I... D How do I get sacked? After I won the league, they just now... No. I was not good enough. You won the league, but that was obviously not good enough. What a bullshit. How can you get sacked when you win the league? And they say ch challenge worthy. I don't know if this were thinking like I'm. I'm just going to start another venture. 
It's the same name. I mean, this is ridiculous. In what world get do? This is not Manchester City. <laughs> I mean, we are champions, so we are promoted. Isn't the champion promoted? Now I'm just confused. Now I really don't know what to do. I should just. I mean, <laughs> no. This is stupid. This is obviously fucking ridiculous. Recent managed club. I don't care if this is considered cheating because this is, this is fucking stupid. I mean, in what world do you get sacked after winning a fucking league? <laughs> she replaces. <laughs> That's funny. I, I don't care. This is stupid. Sure, if I would have been freaking... I don't understand this. I don't fucking understand this. We won the league. What? What is the problem? <laughs> I don't understand this at all. I guess we'll see. But I, I'm, I'm, I'm just confused. Have you ever seen anything more ridiculous? Getting sacked. Okay, I know we did not win. But for God's sake. We're still top of the league. How is that less like... Oh, well, you have not won enough matches. <laughs> so, yeah, I guess I will be back. And if there is a promotion playoff, I guess I will see after that match. Hiring her is a bad decision because it is the same name on the manager. I mean, what well does that make sense? <laughs> Especially since I am. Maybe it is because of my facility. But I'm going to just call that BS because uh, it was like when uh, it was the same as when uh, um, Loki Doki. Um, I guess the I guess this section here with Club Vision isn't made for lower league. <laughs> See, which but yeah, they got annoyed with him because he didn't he did not challenge for the uh, league. But I obviously challenge for a league, and I even won the league. Well, that's not good enough. We want to win the league with more. <laughs> oh well, uh, I will be back with... I know this is kind of considered cheating or whatever too. In what world do you get sacked when you freaking win the league? Uh, discussion or resulting of a departure. It's like... In what world would you sack a manager that's won three promotions in a row? That totally makes sense. Well, I will be back. Sure, if I get sacked for not achieving the goals, that would make sense. But if I get sacked just because the game is, can't handle freaking lower league mansions, I'm, I'm not going to care about the game. A 4 to 4 goal difference as well, but oh, I'm rambling on, so see you soon. Hello, and welcome back here to the playoff. Um, yeah, it seems like everyone <laughs> fourth division play a playoff. And we meet... Wait, uh, yeah, they lost in the semi-final, so... The teams that finish uh, second get uh, to play in the semi-final and those who win go up. So it's a lot of teams that actually go up. Uh, or if we win the league we go straight up. So yeah. Uh, we are favorites and as you can see we won 5-1 uh, against Esteros. Olauson scoring a goal and... Uh, could just offer for addition with uh, two goals there, but yeah, I was so, so apparently since the window is open we can use we can really straight players and as you see it's already four stars So he goes right into the first team even if it's just played one match. So Yeah, uh, going with this line up here and uh, Drago, oh we should probably no Okay, doesn't work there. Birjusson is apparently one of our best, unfortunately. Moriali, whatever his goal, we can't play him, sadly. Oh, we can actually get in someone else. Tommy Mella, I guess. Player we have on loan, he's uh, gone out, apparently. But well, we go in this 
line up here. Hopefully we get through. Uh, I had to restart with another match since I got sacked even win the league. I don't know what's that all about, but well. Uh, Drago, Adnan, Birjusson, uh, Westerlund, Ali, uh, Holmquist, Bukalin, Fredriksson, Olausson, uh, Eriksson, jo Jonathan Eriksson, Isa Lundin där. Vad är Isa Mustafa, <laughs> Shipril, Lundin, Korsmach, will be annoying. <laughs> That might get sacked that way again. Then I might end the series, but it's which just like that other club. And wasn't that Tulling as well, but it's, it's another Tulling tripped. Fredriksson? Scores! 12th goal! I'm, I feel like he scored the most goal. This might be my best signing, actually. He's from Frey from the beginning. What a season! 12 goals and 10 assists. They might actually have more. <laughs> the annoying thing as well, while getting sacked, is I'm still the where well, was I, my manager retired since I had to get a new manager. It was the same age. It, it doesn't seem at all weird for the board, just but yeah, <clears throat> it's going to be tough next season. I'm going to delete some leagues like Division 6 and Division 5, I think. Uh -huh. So yeah, I hope we get this is neutral venue, actual neutral ground. Bukalin scores, Terrapong Bukalin, and so far very, very clinical here, fact. Uh, so yeah, I guess we'll see when we can get to be a professional club. Oh, Isa Lundin almost scored there again. So yeah, it seems even more bizarre to get sacked, but I hope you do not mind, even if it could co be considered cheating, but I mean, who gets sacked when they are like top of the table just because losing the last match? I mean, we still secure the, the league then. Ahmed Ali scoring gun. I'm not sh Well, he's... It's weird. They say that he's good, can approve, but I think his stats is already really good. I, I'm still nervous, you never know <laughs> what would happen. And I say, oh well, you did, did get promoted, that was too good, we sack you. <laughs> you don't want to go up this season, want to go up next season. Yeah, I think it's just the game content. So, board Lenge we play at. Uh, I don't know. I think this is team in the north, maybe. Yeah, uh, it's the sun. It's really weird. We're playing in like board I believe is Dalana or very west. In the west. Part or whatever, <laughs> I don't care. I don't know what to say really. I guess we hopefully we get the uh, boards as well and we can see that. Ali, Bukalin, it's, it's nice to have some players here actually. I think we need, I, I guess we're gonna see how much good that he gets and have a Laos on that definitely. I think it's gonna be good enough for a Division 3 and uh, Division 2 even, but. Lisa Lundin, I think also uh, he's definitely good as well. Jonathan Eriksson, but and Holmquist and unfortunately uh, Holmquist doesn't want to sign a new contract, so I don't know what we're going to do after next season, even if we go up to Division Two. So yeah, I'm going to get rid of Division Six and Five now. Just be, so it get uh, so it works a little bit faster. <sighs> Do we even? I guess. Oh, I hope Christopher. N I did not show that, but Christopher Nilsson's goal in the last uh, last match against Westerwolves was just brilliant. 
Oh, they're pushing forward here though, so that's kind of... Eh, not great, Andreas Lindgren. I mean, Holmquist, I'm kind of surprised it's been so... Uninspiring, <laughs> whatever. Maybe he doesn't want to play here. Oh, no, we don't want to have any mistakes here. Yeah, I'm going to wait to make all the changes. Nielsen is doing a great run here, though. Can he put in the cross? Ooh. And was that good in the first match? I was like, oh, well, he's probably going to do it good here as well. But maybe it was putting too much pressure on such a young player. Oh, I don't feel confident now. Oh, great, there, Birison. Yeah, Birison is surprisingly started now a lot in central midfield. We definitely have to improve there. Iselundin to Jonathan Eriksson. He's still a poacher and hasn't even scored up many else. I guess he come in in the middle of the season, so I guess we shouldn't complain too much still. I, I have to check this Kosovo. <laughs> it's what weird. Uh, after I got some sacked and such, uh, they moved him up to the first team. was like, why? We can't a a anyway ring straight in this field yet, so Kosovo. Diamond-esque formation here and then. Hopefully, 4-1, it looks solid. Hopefully we do this and not stumble. Last six minutes. So now they are up to Division 3, uh, Sal running Salm, and that's, uh, I saw that was the best division, it was in the 95, or something like that, it was a while ago, or it was, <laughs> I don't know, I can't remember what should it date it was, but I can't remember, oh, of course the scores is, oh, it's so weird. Why Why is that even a thing? We're playing in December, the 1st of December. It's just weird that we can register a new player in the same with their team. How, what? How can you register a new player for the last match of the season, which is the most important match of the season as well? No! Oh, great save there. 4-2. No, we are in clinical, taking our chances here. See, our defense... Eh. I still feel we have to prove, but <laughs> that's the issue. We have Morel, uh, so as you can see, uh, Mohamed Ali. Uh, yeah, and he's not going to get better either, so I'm just going to let him go. We're going to see and what else that we can let go here. It's a youngster. The extra is done pretty good. I don't think anyone else is like terrible. We have D in there. You can play in both positions, but it's more of a right back. Fans like this play as well, so it seems silly to let them go. I uh, don't know, I guess we could just see a third division player. So those four are... He's a third division player, Annan as well. To be fair, we might, might actually need to make some strengthen up a little bit here. Um. See here is two star bear. He has a lot of potential. This fellow is is still only fourth edition. Uh, 110 days. <laughs> That's sad. Uh, is it anyone? Uh, Ali Musarelli. And we have him, this goalkeeper. So we have some goalkeepers here. That's not really there yet. But ever can we get the wards? I would like to see that. Yes, this is what I'm waiting for. I might cut out this if it's going to take too long yet to show. Uh, here we go. So, best overall. <laughs> Just all new players, actually. Uh, or Ahmed Al Bilgen. How can he still be <laughs> first choice? He's not even played. Uh, Stranell. He was not even that great. Uh, goal of the season, actually, under your home. Is this really better than Nilsson's goal in the last? I mean, this might be more important, but I just love the goal he scored. And that's fairly lovely, but almost feeling like the goal Nilsson scored was better. They scored goal of the season, youth, uh, best youth player, Isa Dundin. 
seems weird to let go of a strike that is called 20 goals. I guess I guess that he's not going to be as better, so I'm not sure if we would get him in. So we need strikers, maybe. I mean, we are going to see that in the end, what we need. Christopher Fridrikson with most assists, his best average rating, best cost pass completion, Siggy Musso is pretty decent still, 5 star potential, it's just he's not improving that much it feels like. Uh, uh, Christopher Fredriksson best thing, uh, Ali Adnan with 8 and Fredriksson with 2 red cards, that's pretty extreme. Promoting by winning the league. <laughs> That goal that is at least my I know it was it doesn't really matter in this match since we were already promoted and it was like the last goal of the season, which is also a little bit weird than this goal of the season. Man, he's just pink and maybe the goalkeeper should have done better, but it was still in the high re <laughs> regions of the goal there. Let's see what to say. Um, right back looks really good though, with two for free starts there. Even Emil is not good enough. I guess we'll see just what we need to do. Probably <laughs> strengthen a lot. We'll play the center on mid or the midfield is pretty good. Pretty decent lace. Fredrickson, Omquist, Bukalin, uh, Lager, Lamb, Dijkström, and Lawson. <laughs> Yeah, one striker there, or actually just two strikers in the entire team. Yeah, <laughs> left back, because all all the three of them is actually right back, so... First off, we need to get uh, just better striker and more strikers. It doesn't work with two, just, uh, even if we use sometimes just one striker. Might actually be better to actually get some other ones here. I guess we'll see, I'm not going to get rid of players, I don't know how many players do we have right now in the first team. 22. Yeah, I'm not I'm not just going to let go of players just because I can um, drag up <laughs> the signing. Everyone else is not uh, support supporting me, but oh well. Thank you all for watching, I hope you do not mind me getting a lot of badge here because that was just stupid in one sense. After winning the league three times but nope apparently not good enough but well thank you all for watching have a good tea and a good coffee day and now i will just go through the the whole period of before preseason so yeah see you all soon again so bye